welcome Rochelle Eight. If Sam Champion is Ken, this is definitely Barbie. <laughs> Hello, Thank beautiful. You. Hello, how you doing? Uh, how you doing? <laughs> so you're a New York girl. I am. I had no idea. Yep. Where'd you grow up? In Harlem. Ah. Oh. I love your new show. Thank you. Oh. Mistress, this is so good. Thank you, I'm so excited. And now, um, I saw that you have a poster in Times Square. Was that a big, big deal for you? Oh, my God. I was so excited. And thank goodness I was in New York at the time. So I went down there to Times Square uh -huh. and I had my girlfriend take a picture of me. <laughs> yeah. You see it? Oh, yes. Uh -huh. I wanted one by myself. You. Yes, but then the superhero just jumped in there. So. <laughs> Always doing something there in Times Square. Yeah. But it's a great role. It's a great show. Um, you're one of the leads on the show, which is even you know better. Uh, tell us more about your character. Right. So you saw from the clip that my husband had a mistress and she had a baby. So I have been, my character is just going through such a roller coaster ride. And she's fighting back pretty much the whole series. She's just trying to be strong. She also has a daughter who is also going through her own thing. You, you'll see that later in the series, mm -hmm. how she's kind of rebelling. Um, my character is a bit naive and, and innocent. She's trying to get back into the dating world, mm -hmm. but she's nervous about it, which is fun to play, yeah. you know? But she is just, you know, trying to be strong throughout the whole thing. And she does. She fights back. She's a force to be reckoned with. Very entertaining. So um, have you been shooting lots of sexy scenes that we haven't seen yet? My character shoots one in particular, one sexy scene where uh, it's actually in my shop. Yes, it wasn't really planned, but you know what? She wanted to do something spontaneous mm -hmm. because she never does. Yes. <laughs> yes, so um, the shop was closed, though. Uh-huh. Um, uh -huh. And she, um, yes, she has sex on one of the beds that she actually sells. <laughs> now, in, in real life, are you more of a free spirit? Uh, a free spirit? I think so, in, in a way, but I also think about, I, I also like to make decisions smart, you know, yes. I don't want to make wrong decisions, you know. Yeah, well, I mean, one false move as an actress, and, you know, all your business is in the, uh, in the tabloids or something. Right, I like to be private. Yes, yes. Uh, and, and I'm trying to tell you, I couldn't find anything on you. All right, so. This, this, there is nothing. I, I'm boring. I know that you're single, <laughs> from what I was reading, and yes. you don't have any children? I don't have any children, no. Um, but who do you date? I never see you falling out of clubs drunk. <laughs> and when do you never win? <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but, but who do you date? I mean, are you I, dating? I am, yes. I'm dating. I'm definitely dating. And um, sometimes it's in my industry because that's who I meet. Yes. Guys who are actors. Um, but, yeah, I'm just, just out there dating. Just Nothing dating. serious yet. But yes. I, I'm definitely ready. I'm looking for the Do one. you date multiple because I always, I, there's yeah. nothing wrong, yeah, there's nothing, yeah. but there's nothing wrong it's with hard. saying that. Yeah. It's like, we as women, we're taught to, you know, keep our legs closed and, you know, that whole bit. Just because you're dating doesn't mean you're sleeping with somebody. Exactly. And I always feel like if you're a single woman and you want to be in a relationship, well, life is short. You got to date like three or five people at one time and then <laughs> get down from there. Yeah. I do have a hard time, though. I have a hard time dating more than one person at a time because I'll start liking someone and then I'll spend my time with them and we'll, you That's know. fine. For a while. Do you have yeah. a celebrity crush? A celebrity crush. Well, I must say that Usher has been um, That's your type. one of my crushes for That's, a while. What is it about Usher? He is sexy. He can dance. He's, a, you know, I love a man who can move. He seems like he'd be a mean man too. Do you like a mean man? I like a, I like a. <laughs> like I, I, I like not not a mean man, but I, you know, I like a man, you know, because I'm a, yeah, yeah. a big mouth broad. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't like a mean man, but I like a man with edge. I'm That's from Harlem, what I'm so I like him with little edge and someone mm -hmm. who's cleaned up, you know, mm -hmm. but still he has a backbone. A little mean. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, fine. <laughs> fine, a little. Mean. Now listen, here's the other yeah. thing. Rochelle's gonna be in the TLC movie. She's playing Pebbles. So good. 
Okay, so so far we have, we know Kiki Palmer is playing Chili and Little Mama is playing Left Eye. And I was wondering who was going to play Pebbles. It's you. And I watched your show one day when you talked about it. You were like, who, who is playing Pebbles? Right. It was before I got it. And then I got it and I couldn't believe that I would actually be here yes. to talk to you about it. But here's the thing. <laughs> There's not really much that you can say in terms of your interaction because Pebbles is apparently not on board with this whole movie idea to begin with. Right. So how do right. you study her voice? How do you study her? This is what I did. First of all, I spoke to Chili and to um, T-Boz on the phone. I had lunch with them. It, that was oh, amazing. Mm. Yeah. And they gave me a lot of the scoop, mm -hmm. a lot of the stories to mm -hmm. work on from their perspective. And then I went online. There are like four or five interviews that she did mm -hmm. from way back when until now. Yes. And I got to, I just watched her. You know she's a minister now. She's a minister. I know. I know she was praying for everybody on the show that she was on. Mm -hmm. But it was just me just trying to to um, tackle her her personality and her mannerisms, yes. her cadences, and that's that's all I could do. I can't wait for that movie, and I love your new show, Mistress. Thank it you. was so nice to meet you, everybody. This is Rochelle Eight, and you check out Mistresses for yourself. It comes on tonight at ten on ABC. Up next, we're going to reveal our audience eye candy of the day. Don't miss it.